Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna go over all the specs on the Grand Design Imagine AIM 16BL. Plus, I'm gonna talk about if I plan to tow this camper with my Bronco, so stay tuned. Buckle up, Buttercup! The world of RVs is constantly evolving, and the Grand Design Imagine AIM 16BL is a shining example of innovation in compact design. In this video, I'm gonna go over the specs that make the 16BL a great choice for adventure seekers. Measuring in at an exterior height of 10 foot 11 inches, a length of 19 feet 11 inches, and a width of eight feet, the Grand Design Imagine AIM 16BL RV strikes the perfect balance between size and maneuverability. Its compact design ensures an easy journey, whether you're winding through scenic routes or setting up camp in tight spaces. Let's talk weight. The hitch weight is 406 pounds. The UVW, also known as the unloaded vehicle weight, is 3,976 pounds. And the GVWR, the gross vehicle weight rating, is 5,495 pounds. These weight specs contribute to both stability on the road and efficient performance with the proper tow vehicle. This thing is not just a little overland trailer. This thing has a 37 gallon fresh water tank capacity, a 45 gallon gray water tank capacity, and a 37 gallon wastewater capacity. Two propane tanks with a total of 40 pounds of propane capacity, making boondocking easier than before. And that's without mentioning the already installed solar power. But the conveniences don't stop there. The camper also features a tankless water heater, a 6.2 cubic foot refrigerator, a 20,000 BTU furnace, and a 13,500 BTU air conditioner. The AIM 16 BLRV offers a suite of modern appliances to enhance your camping experience from hot showers to cool interiors. These amenities cater to you while you're away from home. It also offers a smooth riding experience. With a single axle, 15 inch wheels, and ST22575R 15LRE tires, whoo, that was a mouthful. The running gear of this camper ensures a smooth and stable ride. These specs contribute to the overall performance, making each journey as enjoyable as the destination. But let's talk interior comforts because you know that's what matters most. Although this camper is only slotted to sleep for, I have successfully slept my family of five. I will have an in-depth video review about how I do that next week. Inside the camper, you'll find a standard bed measuring 60 by 76, standard bunks at 36 by 76, and the other one is 32 by 76, and a convenient 24 by 32 foot shower. Shower's actually pretty big for the size of this camper. These dimensions emphasize both comfort and practicality, ensuring that every inch of space is utilized efficiently, and the layout of this thing is awesome but you do have a camper because you probably plan to spend some time outside, so let's talk a little bit about the exterior comforts. The AIM 16 BL is equipped with one slide and a 12 foot awning, blending the outdoor experience with the indoor comforts. The slide out expands the living space while the awning provides shade for outdoor relaxation as well as your outdoor stove, making it the perfect home on wheels. So don't let this little camper fool you. This camper stands tall in the compact camper world, offering a perfect blend of size, capacity, and modern amenities. Whether you're a seasoned traveler or a first time camper, this RV is bound to make your journey memorable. Now that I got all the specs of this thing out of the way, many of you have been asking, Krista, are you actually towing that with your Bronco? And when people ask me this, I'm like, hmm, I don't think you're paying attention in my videos because I'm pretty sure I've mentioned a couple times, I do not plan to tow this with my Bronco. You may wonder why. Well, my needs have changed. Although I still travel across the country a lot, I haven't been towing an RV as much lately because gas prices are high. But not just that, I really needed a second home base. With starting Buckle Up Off-Road, I'm in Fort Myers a lot, and going to a hotel room every week or so starts to add up. So it's more important to me to have a home base. So I started with my 15BH, and I've parked it here in Fort Myers at the property. 
and I really did enjoy that camper. I took it out on the road and I had a great experience, but when I have the whole family here, it does get a little tight. So I wanted to get a camper that was still small, but bigger on the inside. Now this is about the same size as the 15BH, but the layout does make all of the difference. Although this camper is heavier than my other one, I am still able to use the Bronco to move this around the property. I don't recommend towing this on you know major roads and highways or anything like that but on private property if i want to move locations or something it's totally fine and capable now if i had a bronco raptor maybe that would be a different story maybe i would feel more comfortable towing this unloaded you know not having the tanks filled or anything like that because the bronco raptor does have a higher tow capacity not only that you also got to look at payload but that's a whole nother video all in itself but I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you guys are thinking about the 16BL, I highly recommend it. I can fit my family of five in here comfortably and stay tuned for that video. I'm gonna show you how I do that. But until next time, guys, buckle up, buttercup. Buckle up, buttercup.